Hello friends, welcome back. I am Trilochan. Let's continue with Python series. In the previous tutorial, we discussed iterator in Python, right? In this tutorial, we'll discuss one small project, email slicer. This is one of the convenient Python projects that have a lot of use in the future. The program helps get you the username and domain name from an email address. Suppose that my email ID is trilochan at gmail.com. So we will slice out the username trilochan. Then again, we'll slice out the domain name gmail.com. Okay. You can even customize the application and send a message to the host with this information. So let's see the example here. So let's take you know, one example of like, uh, let's take a custom email ID. Suppose we can put uh, here email ID. We can take input. Here it is. We can write input. Within that, we can write the message. Enter your email ID, right? Enter your email ID. Here it is. So this is you can enter. It will prompt you one uh, the one like enter your email ID so so that you can enter your email ID and the result will be your username and your domain name. Okay. So we can use here one method stripe if you know javascript uh, java and php other languages there's a function trim okay so here in python this is the best option to uh, remove the space uh, before that particular email id and after that email id okay so here it is we are using the strip method so it will remove the spaces okay next is we got the email id okay so as an input now the first work is we have to slice out the username so here you can take one username equals to no this is uh, no need to enter we got the email id so we have to find out the username from this email so email id here you can take and already we have discussed this colon operator okay so here we can do it email id dot index so the first part at the rate uh, of at the rate suppose email id trilogian at the rate gmail.com as i said the trilogian one is the uh, your username and gmail.com is the domain now so here the before uh, at the rate our email id sorry our username right so this is how you can find out your username so similarly if you can copy paste yeah and we can find out the domain name domain okay so domain equals to same email id our email id right here email id and email dot index the same plus we just add one okay here it is plus one and this is the second part so here you would need this one done email id and this is the second part of this one okay so this is how you can got your domain name here so now let me print this one here print the string formatting you will need right so for the i always choose f formatting so here you can write down your username equals to username okay so similarly and you can write down here and your domain name Right. is okay f your username is this username your domain name 
is simply you can write domain so save it okay so let's execute this and see the result here it is enter your email id reload chain at the red email.com okay so here it is uh, an error name email id is not defined here already we have an email id this is email id right oh sorry this is i uh, missed here one l so i think this everything is right yes let's see the let's execute and print it here it is reload chain at the rate gmail.com yes your username is reload chain and your domain name is gmail.com so this is very simple project you can try uh, today now you can try it and i think i think you like this video please do like share comment and subscribe thank you so much for watching